Hey everyone, thought I could walk you through workflow that I created which integrates with the OpenAI right inside the Fabric Index. So I don't generally make a video uh, and uh, I thought, uh, hey, let's do it and kill the bullshit, you know. So here it, here it goes and um, we have one of the use case. Although you can, you know, it has uh, endless possibilities, but you can do whatever the shit you want. It has a crazy shit, it has a endless possibilities and you can do crazy shit, you know. So here is one of the use case I have uh, right now and we for example we have to use uh, OpenAI to create a post content, on, post content on WordPress this would be simple use case right so we have a title in the Google Sheet and we have a public need to do it for us right it has a OpenAI integration that I would uh, share the link uh, uh, right inside the description you can take a look at you can use it to accept the link right so and it would generate the content and then public net would uh, create the post on WordPress obviously. So, so we have a zero content here right now and I have uh, some of the titles that I mentioned here. I would you know, send this data to public connect and uh, let the workflow do the magic for us right. and uh, yeah so let me send the data over to first of all let me walk you through the workflow and this is the google sheet uh, workflow uh, sorry trigger now nah, obviously we know that and this is the open ai integration you can get this once you accept the link and this is the simple action uh, create a post uh, action so we could uh, do this obviously and we have uh, questions here and i would send this data to public net now let's uh, wait for the workflow to do the magic for us let me refresh the page yeah here it is so we have uh, three titles with the content obviously this is not great or uh, you could you know have have the virtual assistant to do the you know uh, review or you could you know pass it to someone to do the better job but right now it has endless possibilities you could do crazy data vision this would be same for most of the content right yeah so one of the other use cases you know you could uh, use this to generate a bulk number of core answers right for example So I have some of the questions that I copied from the QA poll, which you know gives us the number of uh, popular questions that we can use it to write the answers to grow on Quora, right? So, so I have a questions here. Some of the questions right inside the sheet again, and uh, I would send this data to public net, and it would write the content right here. You know, this is the simple workflow as well. So we have. Uh, trigger here and open AI and we have the update dot uh, action here as well so so let me send the data again obviously I will not uh, walk you through the each steps because <clears throat> it would take a lot of time but uh, I will let you figure out this you know it's a uh, pretty pretty much as simple but uh, obviously you can do it you know if not you can obviously let me know I will uh, see if I can make a, another video yeah here it is so they are not the best but uh, let me see So this is the question and uh, we have uh, answers here. You can obviously use this to write up answers on Quora and grow your business right. So apart from this, obviously it has, like I said, it has uh, endless possibilities. You can do wonders with the opening. So right now, oh, this is the, some of the basic work, uh, use cases that I think of. You can obviously think uh, think uh, you can get let your creativity get into work and do crazy shit. I hope this uh, video somewhat helps you. 
and uh, let me know if something else uh, you would like to know now <clears throat> yeah that's all